I'm Darren White from GEG UK, the new Rickstones Academy. And in this video, we're going to look at how you can use Google Forms to differentiate your lessons from the outset, testing students' prior knowledge, and then providing them with follow-up materials as a result. So I'm here in Google Classroom, and what I want to do is create a quiz assignment. So I go to quiz assignment, and I'm going to make this a do now task. This is something that my students have been working on. And in the instructions, I'm just going to say to them to answer the question and then complete the follow-up activities provided. Okay, and the activities they're going to get will depend on the answers they give. I'm going to import the grades, but I'm only going to make this one mark. All I want it to be worth because it's one question and I want it to be in the topic of angles. So we open up our Google quiz now. And we're going to give it a title. We're going to call it Do Now. And do the same here, Do Now. Uh, over here we call it Angles. And first question is very simply just going to be to establish their prior knowledge. So what is the total interior angle of a triangle? And that's something I would expect students to recognize. I'm going to make it a required question and give them multiple choice, three options. So now I'm going to go to my answer key. I'm going to tell Google Forms that I want it to be worth one point, like we've already discussed, and I'm going to tell it the right answer. And this is where the magic really starts to happen. So I can come to add answer feedback. And for the students who've got incorrect answers, I can provide them with follow-up information. So I can ask them to watch the video and then complete the um, textbook exercises okay. and I can use the link icon here and you can see that we can bring in any information we like so I've got first of all here a video from Corbett Maths on how to work out the angles of a, a polygon so I'm going to add that in there and I'm just going to call this video and click add to make sure it's added correctly and I'm going to add a second one which is the textbook exercises, so students can then watch the video and then apply that knowledge um, using the textbook exercises to help them. And then they can check those answers accordingly. So that's those with the incorrect answers. Those with the correct answers, we can say, well done, and ask them to challenge themselves. Now try the exam questions to challenge yourself and again I can use the link I can come over here pick up the exam content questions drop it in where I'd like it and put it here exam questions and you can see I can also add a YouTube video so we click add we save and we can see now that students with the correct answers will get the exam questions and the incorrect answers will get the video to refresh their memories and a chance to practice a little bit more before they move on to those exam questions. So we just click done now, we return to Google Classroom and we can set the assignment. And that's it. That's how we can use Google Forms to differentiate our lessons from the outset based on students' prior knowledge. Thanks for joining me.